Welcome everyone, it is Andrew here from iDownloadBlog. Today we are going to take a look at everything you need to know for Apple's Night Shift Mode available in iOS 9.3. Starting with the basics, the icon for Night Shift Mode has been added at the bottom of Control Center. Kind of looks like a sun-moon combo. And when activated, it makes your screen a little bit warmer. And basically that's supposed to be a little bit easier on the eyes as you try to get ready for bed. Obviously, when I toggle it on and off quickly, you'll notice a drastic change between the really cool screen to the slight bit more warm screen. So if we wanna actually go in and look at these settings and how you can configure this for your liking, you can jump into the display and brightness settings, and here you have an option for night shift now. So if you have this scheduled, it means it'll turn on and off automatically for you without you manually having to do so. So if the schedule is off, the only way it'll turn on and off is if you do it by opening Control Center or asking Siri. If you have it scheduled, you can have a couple options. You can have it based on the sunrise and sunset, or you can have a schedule of your own liking where it turns on a certain time and turns off at a certain time every day. Lastly, you can control the actual warmth of the display. So when it's on, how do you want it to look? Do you want it to be more cool or do you want it to be more warm? By default, it's somewhere in the middle, but the warmer you make it, the more it's gonna be a little bit more yellow and you may start to notice it other places in the system. When it's right in the middle, you don't notice it as much, but it does reduce that blue light that's supposed to help you sleep better. A few limitations to night shift mode, it only works on newer devices, namely those that are 64-bit running iOS 9.3, and also it won't work in low power mode. So if you have that low power mode turned on, basically when you have lower battery, like below 20 or 10%, it's gonna disable that. You'll notice when it's on, there's that yellow bar inside of your battery icon, that lets you know you are inside of that low power mode. When low power mode is on, you can't do anything with night shift. If you open up Control Center, it's disabled. If you go into Settings, it's disabled. However, there is one trick to get it to actually work. If you ask Siri to enable Night Shift Mode, even with Low Power Mode on, this will actually activate it. Granted, you're not gonna get as much out of Low Power Mode because this does take up a little bit more battery, but if you are looking to cut back and save a little bit of battery while having Night Shift Mode on, that is a way to do so by simply asking Siri iOS's 9.3 has been out for a while now, so let us know what you think of Night Shift Mode down in the comments below. Please subscribe if you like this video and check out our full rundown of what's new in iOS 9.3. And until next time, this has been Andrew for iDownloadBlog.